To write the name for AlBr3, we first need to realize that this is an ionic compound. It has a lot of covalent character to it, but we're going to consider this an ionic compound because we have a metal and a nonmetal. Specifically, because we have two different elements, we call this a binary ionic compound, and we can use these rules to write the name. First, we write the name of the metal as it appears on the periodic table. So Al, that's aluminum. Then we write the name for the nonmetal also as it appears on the periodic table. Br, that's bromine, lowercase b. Next, we're going to replace the ending with IDE. So we make this IDE. So the name for AlBr3 is aluminum bromide. Sometimes this is called aluminum tribromide because the electronegativity difference between this Al and the Br isn't quite as large. So there's a large degree of covalent character in the compound. This is the more accepted name though, aluminum bromide. This is Dr. B with the name for AlBr3. We're going to call it aluminum bromide, but you may hear it as aluminum tribromide as well. Thanks for watching.